What's going on my dudes? One Step here with the top five best characters in Street Fighter 6. Take it one step at a time. First things first, my dudes, if you enjoy Street Fighter and fighting game content, make sure to subscribe here for more because we have new videos Monday and Friday. Now, I've spent dozens of hours playing Street Fighter 6, including the beta, all the game modes combined. I've even made a beginner's guide for all the characters in the game. So I have tons of experience when it comes to these characters and what makes certain characters better over others overall. Before we get in there, I want to say a disclaimer that just because a character is considered the top five best does not mean that anybody can just pick up that character and instantly be good with that character. Like a really bad player can pick up the best character possible and still be a really bad player. And vice versa, a really good player can pick up a really bad character, but yet be a really good player still. Though the characters are objectively better than others, I believe that's all about the player behind the controller. With that being said, let's start our list. Ken is a staple character in the Street Fighter franchise and he absolutely makes this list. Ken is one of the most popular characters in the game because of his aggressive moveset. I mean, this version of Ken and S SF6 retains his run mechanic from SF5 while also providing a lot more options to his close range tool set with a lot of unpredictable mix ups, good grabs, awesome damage for his combos, it's just so many tools in his kit it's hard to ignore how good he is. Plus he's pretty beginner friendly and I love to see that. Now Guile is a little bit different than Ken, he's a little bit harder to understand from the get go because of his charge inputs but it's very difficult to know what to do against an experienced Guile player as it can just feel like he has an answer to everything you throw at him. He's got sonic booms for projectiles, great anti-air. He can also control the speed of his projectiles to throw off your opponent's timing. His basic combos can deal devastating damage in an instant and his advanced combos can also last so long before ending in a super arm. He's a great character for both beginners and experts. Mommy Marissa definitely makes our top five list here. One of the newcomers to Street Fighter, Marissa has the most fun game plan in my opinion. Many of her moves come with a stack of armor allowing you to go through your opponent opponent's attacks and even drive impacts. She's got great counters to almost all of her opponent's moves. She's super aggressive, great corner play, and can also put her opponent in the corner pretty easily with super R3 for forward moving combos. She can just stack on a pile of pressure with long reaching normals and decent combo potential and just a heavy hitter overall. Another newcomer to Street Fighter, JP is one of the few true zoners in Street Fighter 6. JP, he's got a pretty distinct advantage when fighting afar. He's able to really fling out all kinds of psycho power with simple inputs and knock away his opponent with lows and overheads, even grab them from afar, set up traps to make your opponent really second guess, how am I gonna get in there? You can teleport to that trap and put the pressure on then. His toolkit is just so vast that once mastered, he can be a menace on the field. Next up on our list, we have Kimberly. Kimberly is a very difficult character to evaluate as she is so annoyingly fast. She's got a teleport, she's got great mix up, she's got an air grab, she has a combo grab, she has the spray can trap, trap setup that can apply so much pressure then rush in and do a combo or even just grab you. Because she's so fast, has great mix-ups, great grabs, great combo potential, once mastered, Kimberly is gonna be disgusting out there. Now some honorable mentions that you could argue should make this list. Our first honorable mention is Manon. Manon has the potential to be one of the best grapplers in the game as her throws can easily wipe out a quarter of your opponent's health bar. Now, given this does depend on her metal level, but that does increase over time pretty easily. You can bamboozle your opponent into punishing them with your grabs, really good pokes, good mix-ups, great combos, okay supers, honestly just so much fun to play. Manon is going to be an absolute force out there. Our second honorable mention goes to Kami. If you liked Kami in previous games because of her rush down strategy, well no worries, she's the same person in Street Fighter 6. She even walks faster than other characters, so her fast fighting combos and damage is absolutely crazy. You can do so much before your opponent even blinks. She can easily close the distance, cancel into supers, has great mix-ups, has great grabs, a great cami scares me. Let me know down below which characters do you like the most in Street Fighter 6? Which do you think are the best? Let me know down below. In your fighting game journey, make sure and take it one step at a time and I will see you in the next one.